Convention of States, to me, uh, is, is a way in which we can reclaim some of the power that has been usurped by the federal government and restore it to the states. I realize this is a, it's a long process and it, it's happened over a number of years, but for the purpose of re having it available to my children to be able to, to live in a, in a country with that is limited debt that has, uh, has non, uh, has, has congressmen and federal officials that are not permanently ensconced in Washington. And to be able to have a higher level of liberty for ourselves, for our, uh, for our children, for our posterity, for our grandchildren. Uh, what has happened with the, with the Constitution, essentially, is that over a number of years, there has been changes to the structural elements in, in, in as much as we, we now are not able to get uh, that, we don't have that balance between the federal and state governments that allows us as peers to, to be able to, um, uh, to do those things through a legislative process. All those things come with strings attached from the federal government. Uh, and so this is necessary to restore the balance between the federal and state governments so that we can do things through the regular legislative process at a more local level. Utah is known nationwide as a place in which liberty is, is fostered, where liberty is important to the people. Utah is looked to as kind of the moral compass of the nation in a lot of places where uh, there, we actually do have other states that are looking to us to lead forward in this process, along with a couple of other states, but Utah in particular needs to lead out. We're the, possibly the most conservative state in the nation, uh, one that li loves liberty the most, and we need to be in on this. Sign the petition at cosaction.com and get as many of your friends and family to do the same. With your full address, your state legislators will know that you really are their constituents in their district. Our success depends on you, so we're inviting you to be part of history. Let's invoke the constitutional solution that's as big as the problem.